Hey YouTube, this is Daniel Vanover. Welcome back for another Technology Tip of the Week. This week we're going to look at Google Hangouts, how you can use Google Hangouts to get in touch with someone through text and video calling. This is a great way for you to be able to reach out to someone, whether it's for advice, for assistance with something on your computer, or you simply want to do a video conference with a group of people and show off your screen that has a slideshow on it. It's a great way to do online presentations. So let me share my screen with you and we'll get started with using Google Hangouts. So we're going to start out in Gmail first of all. Gmail has a built-in Google Hangouts panel on the left. You can also go to hangouts.google.com and get to your Google Hangouts. But I would much rather use the Google Hangouts panel that's built into Gmail. You may not see that panel, so if you click on the Hangouts icon at the lower left, it will show your name and any chats that you're currently in. If you don't have any chats, it'll say no recent chats, start a new one. And you can do that by clicking on the plus button. Click on the plus button and then choose who you want to chat with, either from the list of recent chats, you can also type in someone's name, email address, or phone number to text chat them. And you can start a new group of people by clicking on new group and entering in names, email addresses, or phone numbers to start a group chat. We're just going to do a quick text chat, and I'm going to do it with myself. Start typing in my email address, and it'll appear. If someone's name doesn't show up, just continue to type their email address. And select their name. And now, over here on the right, you will see a Google Hangouts pop-up that appears. And this is for you to be able to chat with someone through Google Hangouts. You can send them a brief message. They'll receive your message. They can respond back to you from their device. You'll see that someone has read a message because their picture will show up below the most recent chat that they have read. If they haven't read a message, their picture will show above your most recently sent chat. To start a video call with someone, first open up a text chat window and click on the video call option. And this will start a video call with the person. So once the video call is going on, you're able to screen share your video screen with the other person by clicking on the green screen share button at the top left. If you click the green arrow, you will be given the option of screen sharing. You can screen share your entire screen or just an application window. So if you wanted to screen share just your email or just a window with uh, a website in it or a slideshow, you can click on the application window tab and then choose the screen that you want to share with the other person and click share. And now your screen will be shared with the other person. You can stop sharing with everyone by clicking on stop. And it goes back to your video. You can invite people to the video call by clicking on the Invite People button. You can also mute your microphone, turn off your webcam, and back on again, and change your bandwidth usage. This allows you to change how high of quality your video is sending out. So if you notice that your video is lagging a little bit, you may want to change the quality down to medium or low, or even down to very low, or audio only if you're really having issues with network. The settings gear will allow you to switch which webcam you're using, which microphone you're using, and which speakers you're using, as well as playing test sounds and checking whether or not you want Google Hangouts to report additional diagnostics to Google to help improve the Google Hangouts experience. To end a call, you simply click the red phone button that ends the call. And that's how you get started with Google Hangouts. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you get updated on new videos as I post them. If you like this video, then give it a thumbs up. Again, this is Daniel Vanover with your Technology Tip of the Week using Google Hangouts. Have a great week. We'll see you next time.